All right. Hey. Hello, everyone. My name is Terry Collins with Millennium Realty, and I'm here with Miss Cam. Hi. And Cam is going to tell us a lot about her business here in Ridgeland. She uh, specializes in photography and healing. So, Miss Cam, tell us a little bit more about your business. All right. So, I'm Cam, obviously. Thank you. Um, I'm a photographer. I've been a photographer for 10 years um, plus. But the part about photography for me is that it's a healing mechanism. Everybody awesome. has their ministries, right? Yes. Um, I'm not a, a minister and then a preacher, mm -hmm. but I believe God gave me a vision to see beyond what the surface is. So I always tell people, I take pictures of not just what you look like, but who you are. Awesome. Because that's what we do. We tell the story here. Fantastic. Um, and so I specialize right now in this month, I'm specializing in families because I'm new to the area. So mm -hmm. I want to meet as many people as possible, introduce them to the CAM era, which is my business. Right. And um, But come January, I'm going to really hone down on my specialty, which is maternity images and funeral photography. Awesome. So tell us a little bit more about that, the maternity and the funeral aspect. Okay. Um, I'm a painter. I paint people. Body painting, actually. Um, and that was really the catalyst into art for me. Mm -hmm. I started seeing people um, not as black or white or Hispanic, but gold and uh -huh. silver, like serious metallic colors. Mm -hmm. And I thought, well, that was just strange. And one day I asked this guy, could I paint him gold? And when I did, it was just such a uh, moving process. Awesome. And I just saw him as a very godlike sort of figure. Mm -hmm. But the next day, when I put the images out, this woman was pregnant. And she said, wow, have you ever thought about doing maternity images and um, in your style? And I said, no, I didn't think about it. And when I painted her, it was as if we could hear heaven. Awesome. Um, the baby felt so calm. The energy mm -hmm. in the room was amazing. And I really felt like I was um, offering pregnant women an opportunity to be seen in all of their beauty and to really be appreciated and to be still mm -hmm. because when you're birthing and yes. giving life you're never still mm -hmm. and so for me to um, be able to take over that process and paint and then photograph them and give them lasting art that isn't just a pregnant body but something that's a little more ethereal it's right. been fantastic. Fantastic. And that's something that's new, mm -hmm. that a lot of pregnant women are taking pictures, and they are beautiful. And I did look at some of your gold and, and silver images, mm -hmm. and I think they are great, too. So we're going to make sure that we post some of those Thank on the website. You. I didn't take pregnancy images, and that's the one regret I have. I've got right. three kids. And I'm so ashamed of my right. pregnant body. The exactly. stretch marks and the... At that time, it wasn't... Mm -hmm wasn't deemed as beautiful. Right? Mm -hmm. It's so true. That's sad. Mm -hmm. but and it's always yeah. life. Yeah, I know. So mm -hmm. here we are. Yes, ma'am. So great. So uh, you said that you've been doing photography for 10 years, but what actually got you started uh, in, photography. in this business here? Oh, uh, in Jackson? Yes. All right. So I've been a little bit all over the place. I started in Jackson. I was born and raised here. Awesome. Um, went to all JPS schools, and then I started working at the news station right after college, mm -hmm. WAPT. Awesome. Thought I'd be a news reporter, this famous <laughs> uh, girl on TV. I was okay. like, it was the dream. Yes. But reality hit, and news reporting was, um, you know, I deal a lot of murders and, and um, crime. Right. It just doesn't work with how I like to exist every right. day. And so I started looking for other careers, right? right? And so I moved around, bounced around, I did pharmaceutical sales, I did um, just dancing, some acting, and then eventually I, I wound up back in Boston and I went to photography school. Um, a few more trips around the world. Mm -hmm. I said, I want to come home. Yeah. I'm tired of traveling and I want my kids to really grow up and um, be around grandma mm -hmm. and my family awesome. and my roots. And so I really just made the commitment one year and I said, I'm coming home. So three months later, I ended up here in Jackson. Right. And this studio was not even supposed to happen. Let me tell you. Really? I, um, I was sitting, I went across next door mm -hmm. to get some earrings, just shopping. And the girl Ross said, there's a studio next door. You ought to open up a painting and healing session because I've been doing energy healing with her for a while. And I said, I don't know. It's a lot of responsibility I don't know if I'm doing it she was like girl God she was like you always giving messages this is your message the next literally next moment the landlord for this place called and said hey I got a space open right across the hall from you you know anybody who wants to rent it awesome and I was God sitting there I said 
That was quick. Yeah. It was good and quick. <laughs> and quick. And so he said he knew you were going to move. Because I really, I, I swear I had no intention. And he came up 10 minutes later and I was writing him out a check. And then I looked at the empty space and I was like, Lord, what am I going to do in here? And I started seeing shapes and colors and people and um, just a really good calming environment awesome. where we can be and we can explore and where people can come in and not ask me to Photoshop them because they got a double chin, but really accept their double chin. Awesome. And we can get to a place of healing visually. And you know, I think that's a lot of us common people. Uh, I don't like to take selfies and mm -hmm. so I do also have a, a trying to find my good side. Right. And, uh, and I would appreciate if someone could, like you say, help you define that all your sides are good. Mm -hmm. And let me just let you accept yourself as you are. Oh, I got chills. <laughs> I do. I consider myself this coach when I'm in here because right. I can. I can Photoshop you and make you look like anybody because that is a skill set. But it's not what I want to do because it's really uh, projecting a false narrative. Right. And that does no good for anyone. Exactly. Um, so, yeah, when you come in here, I would, if you got a pimple, honey, I will get rid of it because that is not your native right. face. Right, it's not always there. But if you have something, a birthmark, and it's, you know, I think it's beautiful, and I'm going to be the wrong photographer <laughs> if you're asking me to hide what is naturally on your view. Awesome, mm -hmm. awesome. I love that. That sounds great, Cam. All right, so when are you going to come in, girl? Oh, well, I'm on, we're going to have to schedule something. I'm excited. I really want to do it. <laughs> I was, uh, like I said, I was looking at your uh, specials, and so we're going to talk about some of those. Mm -hmm. What specials do you have? You said for this month it's families. Yes, I'm doing mini sessions. And so the mini sessions are just $75, and you come in and I'll do a 20-minute um, session. That's mm -hmm. really all we need. Mm -hmm. And you get um, your digital images because people are in social media. Mm -hmm. And so I'll give you dig digital images plus your full session. And you're going to walk out with um, like a crazy amount of energy. Yeah. I believe that once people really sit themselves down and just enjoy the process of taking the photograph and not being nervous. Right. You know, it, when you leave and see yourself, it changes. So the special is 75 bucks for 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. um, and that's on our Christmas vignette, which is right behind awesome. us. Oh, Christmas. Mm -hmm. in there. We have to make sure yeah, he's yeah, in there. Yeah, you can see the vignette right behind. Um, and there's also uh, something I do. It's called Boutique Mondays. And this is specifically for people who have a business or product. It's $75. And what you do is you bring whatever you want to in the studio and for one hour we shoot as much as we can. Outfit changes, you can get headshots done. I had a girl come in with earrings, she brought in a hundred nice. pair of earrings and we put them in every corner of the studio and we shot all day. We went outside, she had some bracelets on her wrist, we shot. And so that's right. really just an opportunity to let entrepreneurs and business owners and to give that. Mm -hmm. awesome. And to get so many pictures because you know how much content we need daily yes. to put out? Mm -hmm. And so I'm like, listen, bring yes, as I much do. as you can. We're gonna, we don't have to shoot 30 images in one outfit. Right. Cause I'm good. Yeah. We shoot five, we'll get it, change and clothes. Then we'll change. And then awesome. I'll give you all your images and do it. So basically for any shot, we bring our own clothing and then mm -hmm. we go from there. And, and we shoot for an hour and that's the Boutique Monday session, $75. Awesome. And I keep my prices relative to what I needed when I was starting out. Right. I couldn't afford a whole, you know, $250, $400 full-on shoot. Correct. And I do price for that with my paintings. Mm -hmm. And so that's where I make up on the back end. But I just like people. Awesome. So you do paintings also? Only people. Only people. Don't put me on a canvas, honey. Awesome. I cannot. Okay. It'll just look I like got people. you. I got you. Fantastic. So you talked about your future goals. Mm -hmm. And you talked about how you actually did, located in this area. <coughs> Excuse me. So what are some of your favorite places to visit in the Ridgeland area? Oh, well, first off, I love Primo's. Yeah, you want me to grab water. some water? Yeah. Uh -huh. There we go. There you go. Thank you. Excuse us. Excuse us. We up in here. Bless you. Mm -hmm. um, favorite places in Ridgeland. I absolutely am a foodie, so I love Primo's. The caramel cake there. To die for. Oh my god! I think I made <coughs> six or seven pounds alone mm. just eating their caramel cake for lunch. And then Penn's Fish House gave me my whole life because I didn't do uh, fried foods up north. You know, just everybody's on kale and salads. 
And so coming back south, I'm just eating as much as possible. Um, so those are my food places. Um, I absolutely adore shopping at the local places. So Bishy Christie is one of my favorite boutiques. She's right up the road from here, but awesome. her clothes are fantastic. I'm actually wearing most of her stuff today. Fantastic. <laughs> mm -hmm. See if she'd be worn, ready for an interview. Oh, she would. And her right? stuff is amazing. Awesome. Make sure I get that name. Say it again. Bishy Chrissy. Bishy Chrissy. Yeah. Like Bishy that. Chrissy. So um, what would you like to tell your customers about you to make them come in and get this great service that you offer? You know, I think the most important thing people need to understand about me is that I'm a mirror. And before I even pick up a camera, I have experienced and I believe that um, you're in my space because we've experienced something similar and that God has put us together to explore whatever that is. So the camera really is second nature to the purpose. Awesome. And my purpose is to understand why we are reflecting of each other. Okay. And then I pick up the camera uh, to leave you with the lasting memory. I like to freeze time. That's my superpower. Awesome. You know, we Go freeze superwoman. time. Superwoman. We all got one. Yes, ma'am. And so I freeze time and give you that memory. But really, I think what sets me apart is that it's my deep belief that there's no coincidence, number one, and that God brought us into this space in order to be able to see different, so that I can see you different, so that you can see me different, and so that we can see ourselves different. And that is the photography second. Awesome, awesome. Well, Cam, tell everyone what's the best way to contact you. The best way to contact me, um, you can go to my website, www.thecamera, T-H-E-K-A-M-E-R-A.com. Um, my phone number is 443-912, what is my number? <coughs> Lord, we don't call ourselves, let's see. 443-312-9910. I really awesome. had to dial it on the phone. <laughs> I'm a visual person. That's great, most and, of us are. Right, and then my Instagram and all my handles are the same. It's at the Cam Era. And the reason I named it the Cam Era is because my name is Cam, mm -hmm. but number one, I use a camera, so it's interchangeable. And then it's a new era. It's the era of really accepting who we are, how we show up, and even if we want to change it, it doesn't matter because how you are today is how you are today. Exactly. And what you'll be tomorrow. It's we can take another picture. It's only $75. There you go. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. Awesome. Awesome. Well, I thank you very much, Cam. And so we're going to shut down our video here and get ready to talk some more.